<laughs> are, are we vlogging? So cute. Yeah, we are. Are we live? Yeah, we're live. <laughs> hey, audience. Hi guys. Hi guys. Camille's vlog. Welcome to. Welcome. You don't back. have to talk to it. You can just oh, ignore it. it. Okay. That's I, not my style of vlog. So I, I would like, like to it's talk more like to documentary it. Documentary style. Is this Camille's okay. way of saying shut up? Oh, is it just yeah. gonna shut be like up. a time lapse or something? The like that? last. It's the last ten days of school vlog. Aww. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna like record Except like every day. There's, it's not the last ten days; it's eleven days. Yeah, but it's the last day of class. So I want to say. So. All right, all right. So, so the last, last 11, eleven days. days. The last um, eleven days vlog. If I. Oh, it looks like the smiling face is crying. <laughs> the day which is so exciting and today was the last day of classes so I'm officially done with school like forever which is crazy because I'm not planning on going to like grad school or anything so no more school for me okay today's the day um, well actually I don't know what day it is but it's the day I'm gonna finish Spanish basically so here's the fit to take my last Spanish exam. Actually, I don't know why I did that. But I look like a librarian, so that's fun. But I'm probably gonna put some computer on later. But I'm very excited because I dislike Spanish with like a passion. Like, I am very appreciative of the Spanish culture and language, of course. But I just can't do languages. Like, I cannot, whatever I do, I just cannot learn languages. Um, so did I study for this? No, but it's gonna be okay, you know? He said it's just like a quiz, and it'll, it'll just be fast. Like a quiz, hopefully. Yeah, so my Spanish exam is done. It lasted all of like 30 minutes. Um, it was literally just the length of a quiz, and I'm pretty sure I'm gonna get like 20 extra points. So basically we're chilling, and I'm done with Spanish, so that is a big accomplishment, honestly. But yesterday was the last day of classes, and today is like reading day. It's like in between the last day of classes and the start of exams. So I really have nothing to do today, except my sister's coming later, so that'll be fun. But I don't know how to feel about like classes being over. Like, I don't know, I feel like I should should talk about my, my feelings. I don't know. No, but I don't know, I just, I don't know what to say about like classes being over. Like I'm done with school forever, which is absolutely wild. And I don't think it's like sunk in yet. Like I don't think graduation has sunk in. But anyway, I am excited to be done with school because I just don't like school. Like I'm not a school person. I've never have been like a school person. Like I'm more of like a work person, I would say. So I'm happy to be done with school. It's just like weird. Like I'm never gonna have to do school. <laughs> As I was saying, it's like weird that I never have to do school, but it's a good weird. Like it's not a bad weird. It's a good weird. I got crumble cookies for Natalie's birthday. Shh, don't tell her it's a surprise, but she already knows. Um, oh my god. I didn't know if I should just get one or four, so I got four, obviously. But they look so good. I've never had crumble before. This is so awesome. <laughs> Happy Monday, um, it's the last week of school, or I guess school's over, but it's the last week that like we're here at Bering before we graduate, so that is uh, honestly crazy, like it's the last Monday I'll ever be here, 
but I meant to vlog like every day for the past 10 days, but I didn't. Because last week I was like out of town a lot. Well, actually, it's not true. Anyways, last week my sister came Wednesday and then left Thursday. And then Thursday I went to Athens and came back Friday. And the weekend I also went home, so was not here. But this is the last week. I'm gonna be here. Actually, wait, no. <laughs> I was gonna say I'm gonna be here every day until graduation, but we're actually going to one of my roommates' houses tomorrow and we'll spend the night there. So I won't be here every day. But I'm really just trying to like do all the last, like, very things because it's the last week. Like, today's Monday. We graduate on Saturday. So it's like the last week, which is like honestly crazy. Like, I don't know how to feel about it. Like I'm really happy because I really dislike school and I'm glad to just like be starting my life. But I'm also really sad because I love Barry and it's like, oh. So today for my final Monday, I'm gonna hike the House of Dreams. Um, it's like one of the hikes on Barry's campus, but it like goes to Martha Barry's summer house. And I've hiked it before a couple times, but I really like the hike. So I'm gonna do it one last time and yeah we don't really like, have school or anything this week because it's just like finals end tomorrow but i don't have any finals so i'm basically just like chilling and like bumming around until graduation should i hit this goose in the middle of the road oh wait it moved frick i was gonna hit it just kidding just begun it's like three miles there and back so it's only a mile and a half up and I'm already out of breath so check it out but I didn't bring my phone or anything like I only brought this camera because I wanted to like really unplug I kind of always wanted just to like not have a phone just have like a little flip phone or something and just like not bring my phone anywhere guys I made it I'm in the bathroom because I needed to splash my face and drink some water from the sink. But I look like a boy. I just had to say or share that with y'all. I really hope y'all can hear the bells because it's really, really pretty. This is the house of dreams. This is the actual house. The lights and the fan on are inside, but I haven't seen anyone, so. The day has finally arrived. It is graduation morning. Um, yeah, I didn't vlog this entire week, so that's my bad. But it's graduation morning, so that's the only thing that's important, right? So let's see how the roommates are doing. Ah! <laughs> Very exciting. <laughs> what just happened? <laughs> okay, Mama Petty, how are you Good feeling morning. this morning? I'm feeling a little sad and a little nervous. And yeah. Raining. Yeah, me too. Good stuff. We had a giant sleepover, so this is the remnants. Whatever you want, don't call me. <laughs> okay, so how are you guys feeling this fine morning? Feeling the most. Exhibit A. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'm feeling like we 
are gonna get a little wet. Yeah. I already am. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> ladies here on Barry College campus. And how. And I am also feeling mimosa. <laughs> <laughs> and also hoping it doesn't rain because it's currently raining. But But have no fear everyone. I'm taking these bad boys with me home and they're gonna go in my room and I'm gonna stare at them forever. Okay, this is the before. Okay, here's the after. We're graduation ready. <laughs> cute, cute. We just gotta get Natalie's after. <laughs> okay, take a seat, child. <laughs> is that our recording? <laughs> this is recording. Okay, so the next segment of this vlog will be interview. Wait. Wait, start over, start over. The next, welcome to the morning with your host Camille and Andy. Andy, that is Andy. Um, this section of the vlog will be called the day after because it's the day after graduation. So Pan will ask me some questions. <laughs> okay, <laughs> begin. So, how do you feel after four years of hard work in college. Um, <laughs> do you want to join? No, nah, I'm going to Bussies. <laughs> I feel relieved that I don't have to do school again, hopefully ever again. But I don't have to study for a test or like, but <laughs> I don't have to do projects or like care about grades or like homework or Spanish. Or Spanish. Um, I yeah, I feel relieved that I don't have to do school again. What is your top favorite memory out of four years? Maybe top three. If you can um, one. Okay, I'll do. Can I just do one for each year? Yeah. Okay. Freshman year. Favorite memory? Honestly, it's <laughs> it's when my friends and I all drove up to Mountain Campus because we thought, or a specific somebody was doing. Here, wait. I don't know if I can say. That. Uh, <laughs> we'll just say the cheater chase situ situation of freshman year. They'll, they'll know what I'm talking about. <laughs> well, sophomore year? Hey guys. Um, spring break at the beach was really fun. I'll say that. Hey guys. Hey. Hi. Okay. Junior year? Um. Wait, what's sophomore year? I said sophomore year at the oh, beach. Oh, the beach. For spring break. Um, junior year? I don't know. I have like no memory of junior year. Like, junior year is just like blacked out for some reason. Um, oh, I really liked my birthday junior year. Like, my, my birthday junior year was like my best birthday I've ever had. Ooh, um, and then senior year, definitely Petty Farms. We went to Julie's house on a farm, and it's called Petty Farms, and it's fun. We did farm things. And I shot a gun. Which dorm accommodations was your favorite? Oh, definitely Centen Centennial. Live in Centennial, senior year. Definitely. Because it's like so spacious and you get your own room and it's fun. What advice would you give to a new coming freshman in college? Um, join as much stuff as you can. Oh, you should ask me like my regrets. Oh, regrets. Yeah. Okay, so one of my regrets is like not getting involved in recreation. Because I really like rec stuff, so I really wish I did like recreation. Oh my, God, it's oh my god. So my advice would be get involved in stuff. In like everything. And then oh also my advice would be don't date someone in your friend group freshman year. Because that just ruins everything. But I guess I have two regrets. One, not joining recreation. And then two. Um, 
Let's just say I wish I came into college with more morals. <laughs> Leave it at that. <laughs> Those are my regrets. Okay, thank you for the questions. Anything else? No, why are you so ugly? <laughs> no comment. <laughs>